This is a live look at the Trevi Fountain in Rome right now, where people not only want to come to visit this incredible tourist attraction, but also to try to stay cool. It is another day of extreme heat across much of southern Europe. In Italy, 16 cities are under red alert this morning, with temperatures expected to top over 40 degrees Celsius, and it is just beginning. With me now from Bern, Switzerland, is Dr. Clement Abergel, climate application scientist at the European Space Agency. Hello, thank you so much for being with us. So temperatures are sizzling right now across Europe, and they're only expected to get hotter. Talk to us about what countries are seeing the highest temperatures and what records are being broken. Thank you. Yes, extreme heat continues to affect Southern Europe. And as you said, potential record temperatures are expected over the coming days. Country most affected are for now Italy, Spain, Greece, the Balkans and Turkey. Temperature as high as 115 degrees Fahrenheit are forecasted for Sardinia in Italy. That seems to be the epicenter of the heat wave. Mainland Italy is forecast highs of almost 110 degrees Fahrenheit, and the south of Spain could also see highs of almost 115 degrees Fahrenheit, while southern France will peak at 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit, according to the latest uh, forecast. So in Celsius, that's what, about 48 degrees? Indeed, up to 46 for Sardinia, 43 for mainland Italy, and 46 for uh, Spain uh, as well. What is causing all of this extreme heat and why is it lasting so long? Very good question. Periods of intense heat occur within natural weather patterns. But if there is one kind of weather extreme that we can clearly link to climate change is worsening heat waves. Heat waves are getting hotter. They are occurring at a higher frequency, increasing the likelihood of sequential heat waves, and they are doing longer. This year, something else is adding fuel to the fire, so to speak. It is the El Nino climate pattern that is developing in the tropical Pacific. El Nino tends to drive up global temperature and add into global warming caused by climate change. And this could make 2023 the hottest year ever recorded. Last month was already the hottest June on record, according to the Copernicus Climate Monitoring Service from the European Union. What are the dangers to people during this extreme heat? Heat waves uh, are known to be among the most worrying climate extremes regarding the vulnerability of our society. They are already among the deadliest weather-related disasters in many parts of the world. Not only do extreme temperatures may cause heat exhaustion and severe dehydration, but they also raise the risk of having a heart attack or stroke. Uh, an epidemiological analysis just published in Nature Medicine said that the summer 2022 record-breaking heat has caused more than 61,000 deaths in Europe. What's the outlook for the rest of the summer? In the next uh, week, the heat is, continu is continuing to, to build up across uh, southern uh, Europe. That's what we see where we combine satellite Earth observation of uh, land surface temperature and when we combine them with a uh, model to better understand and forecast weather, climate pattern, but also to monitor other risks such as uh, wildfire. Clement Abergel is a climate application scientist at the European Space Agency. Thank you so much.